Hello again and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. I have lately just been really embracing my love for One Piece and Hobonichi basically opened those doors for my channel since they have this One Piece collab. I have acquired several One Piece figures lately and it's always been on my list to add this to my shelves of awesome things and I have just recently been doing so. But on to the Hobonichi haul. I purchased a cover for my husband's weeks along with a pencil board because of course I had to. Look how freaking adorable it is. And I am a huge fan of this manga panel design they have going on for this series so and the color is just perfect too i'm actually thinking of getting another one and using it in my plotter i think it'll fit nicely with the olive color and i think the size is just fine i do wish that they had a green one but you know that's okay this is super cute and i just love how each one depicts a different arc and with that, you know I had to get the other two sizes as well. My husband and I actually went this past weekend to go and watch the One Piece movie Red in uh, theaters. We watched it at Alamo Draft House, and it was so much fun. I was hoping that they would have like themed food items, but they didn't. But we wore matching shirts and we had fun. My sister and her boyfriend joined us as well, and it was just so good. I am curious to know if you are a fan of One Piece, which is your favorite art? My husband and I actually started the show over since we have caught up to the show and we hate waiting every weekend so we still want some One Piece content so we are just watching the show from the beginning. Back to the haul, we do have this memo pad here again depicting more manga panels from various arcs and I'm loving the color, I'm loving the way it looks. I haven't read the manga yet but I have a vague idea of when these are happening in the story. And then they have these cute little letter sets. I'm not exactly sure what they're used for but they have the character's eyes and each one is different and it represents the character and I just, I love it. I don't care if I don't know what to use it for. I am going to use them in my journal, use them in my pen pal letters, display them somehow. I don't know. There's, I believe, three of each character, so I have plenty to use in different ways. I also find it hard to choose my favorite character. I know it's probably just a generic answer to say the main character, Luffy, is my favorite, but he is one of my favorite characters. He is just so charming, and, uh, and of course, Chopper. I mean, Chopper is just so cute, and I can't help it, but I love them all. They're really, you know, there's some I like more than others, but I I don't know if I can choose just one favorite. And if you haven't had a chance to watch the show yet, I highly suggest you do because it is just, you bond so much with these characters. You you develop so many feelings for them and you care about their character development. You care about where the story is going. I have cried so much for this show. Um, it is just so good. I can't, I can't just, I can't express it enough. Next up, I wasn't sure if I was going to get these, but I'm so glad I did. They are the many faces of Chopper little page flags, and I think there's about 20. There's 20 each, I think. And they're just so cute. I don't, I almost don't want to use them because ugh, they're just so cute. Look at that. The voice actress who plays Chopper also voices Konohamaru from Naruto and Pikachu, and it's just, it's the cutest voice ever. I don't know how she does it, but she has the cutest voice ever and it just brings this character to life. Next up are the clear stamps. I lost some footage stamping all of these down sadly and I'm sorry I just didn't go back to refilm it because I forgot. And this is just a little collection of just different things that can be pulled out from the show and the manga like a wanted poster or the straw hat that Luffy wears. Just fun little things that I know I'm gonna have so much fun decorating my planner with. Still Hobonichi related, I did end up getting another A6 cover. I wasn't going to, but then I just kept thinking about it and it was between this one and the Willow one, I think is the, the name of it. And I just went for this one because look at the colors. I just love the gradient. I love the minty kind of blue on the inside. Like, oh, I can't, I just can't. Hobonichi, why do you do this to me? And I just think it pairs so nicely with the one piece collab. I have the A6 in here and oh my god, I can't get enough of it. I just think that the pencil board goes well with it too. I mean, look at this blue. It looks so good. I am so happy. And as tempted as I was, I just think that this white butterfly cover matches my style better than the One Piece A6 cover. I 
still really love my Liberty Fabrics cover, but I am excited to use this next year and just have fun with it. I don't seem to gravitate towards the A5 size in general, but I'm also surprised that there haven't been more A5 covers that I've liked. Nothing has really fully grabbed my attention like the A6 size covers have. Moving on, my husband actually also purchased himself an A6 cover, which I was really surprised by. It came with this adorable striped drawstring bag, which may have influenced him to purchase it. But yes, he did get himself the leather A6 one-piece cover, the Going Merry Logbook, and it is so pretty. Oh my goodness, it has this world map liner inside, and it has this button closure with with the Going Merry face on it, and it's very subtle, like it, you'd have to really be a fan of the show in order to recognize it, but it has this sleek design, and I think it's still, you know, it called to him as a One Piece fan, but he won't be using it as a planner cover, he will be just using it for notes, so we got a a6 cafe notes to go inside it and oh my goodness look at it it just it's so nice and it pairs so nicely with the weeks he is just ready for next year i am just so excited that he also is jumping on the hobonichi bandwagon here with me and then I just wanted to share these two items. We purchased this from Kinokuniya and they're just cute little like character cards. I believe there are several like editions of this with this, you know all of the characters and I just purchased two and I'm just, if you couldn't tell, I just really love One Piece. But that's all I really wanted to share with you today, but I'd love to know if you're purchasing any of the One Piece Hobonichi accessories, and I will catch you in the next video.